What's going on guys, Little Mikey here, and today I'm bringing you guys a brand new video, and this is a video I've wanted to do for a while, but I just never really got to it. Um, this is going to be a video where I mix my G Fuel flavors. I know of a few flavors that I actually have that are good for mixing, and there's others I've just never heard of, so we're going to try mixing almost every combination of flavor we possibly can, and then in the end, I'm going to mix all of my flavors and see what it tastes like. It might be disgusting. But we're gonna try it. So for this, we're gonna be using my Phase G Fuel shaker cup. I really, I absolutely love this shaker cup. It's probably my favorite because um, I don't know. I just like how it's like clear and it's like the colors. I don't know. I'm going to get water and then we'll get to this. Alrighty. So the first two flavors I think we're gonna try mixing are going to be um, watermelon and where is it? F Tropical rain and. These two, I, these are the, this is the one combination I've heard of that is apparently very good. Uh, so uh, let's just get to mixing. It's very difficult to get the ratios right, especially since I'm not using like an entire thing of G Fuel. I'm using half of a shaker cup. So I have to technically use half of each. Like I would normally use half a scoop and then I have to use half of that for each. So quarter of a scoop. So let's just mix this up. It's turning, it's turning gray. Ish. Oh no, it's looking more like a bluish. Actually, kind of looks cool. It's like it's purple almost. Do you see it? I can't really see it. It's turning purple. Like even more. Like this color is kind of pinkish. The face berry. This is actually turning like this is like a like a like a dark lavender looking color. It's kind of difficult. It doesn't really like, show up on camera at all. Actually, it's gray on camera. I guess let's just try it. Hopefully, I got the the ratios right and. It literally, it just smells like a mix of tropical rain and watermelon. I'm gonna be completely honest. It smells kind of good though, so. That's heck. Oh my God. Tropical rain on its own is very, very good. So is watermelon on its own. It is also very, very good. But when you mix them together, this is probably the best combination, the best like G Fuel I've ever drinking, ever. Like the two mixed, this is amazing. It looks gray, but it's actually like lavender pink. I'm gonna go and get to the next flavors. So I guess the next two flavors that we're gonna mix are gonna be Tropical Rain and um, Phaseberry, just because they're both fruity flavors and watermelon is kind of like, or Phaseberry, sorry, is kind of like a better watermelon in a sense, sort of. So we're gonna mix these two and I think this one's really gonna be really good. So I'm gonna guess it's gonna sort of be the same color since the two powders are like, they're like the two drinks are sort of the same. It might be a little, bit, a little bit lighter. Nah, it's looking like it's almost the same. Actually, it looks a little bit darker. Yeah, so it looks like the same. Again, it still looks gray on camera for some reason, but uh, it is, it, it's still like that purplish color. So. so it's all shaken up now and let's try it. I think this one's definitely gonna have a more combination of, or a combination of more flavors. Gonna be totally honest. This really doesn't taste like much. I expected this to taste really like, like have a lot of taste. Like the watermelon and tropical rain one had a lot of taste. This not so much, like it's there but it's not, <laughs> I don't know. Like, like I can I can taste the two, but it doesn't really taste like much together, I guess. I would definitely rank the first mixing way more than this one, because this, I don't know, it's just kind of plain. Like, I don't really enjoy it that much. I really thought this one was gonna be better, but I guess not. So I guess the next flavors we're gonna mix are gonna be Tropical Rain here, and we'll do Peach Mango. Um, I think this is gonna be a very interesting combination. Um, considering they're two very different flavors. Um, I honestly don't think this is going to taste the greatest, but we'll have to see because I've been surprised um, by many things, especially the last one I was surprised by. Um, but let's get going ahead and mix this up. It's going to be gray, I bet. Yeah, it's, it's, it's like a yellowish. It's like a mint green looking color. Like... This does not look very good. It's almost gray, actually, in like in real life. And it looks better on camera, that's funny. It's like this weird greenish, grayish color. Ooh, it's very gritty. <coughs> okay, so again, this this is kind of like the second one. It doesn't really taste like much. I, I definitely taste peach mango because it's a very strong flavor. Um, but so is tropical rain, so. I guess peach mango is a little bit stronger than tropical rain. Honestly, it's not that bad. It has more flavor than the second one. I don't know. It's really not as bad as I thought it would be, but it has more flavor than the second one. I rank this over the second one that we did. Put it that way. Um, I still wouldn't drink it though. It's not very, 
color wise not appealing but taste wise it's better than it looks okay so we got a few more flavors to go so what we're gonna do now is we're gonna mix a watermelon and phase berry together and then we'll do watermelon peach mango and then we'll do phase berry peach mango and then we'll mix them all together <laughs> I would say watermelon is the one I had the least of just purely because um, it's it was my favorite and I it still is my favorite sort of not really green apple kind of beats it oh I poured a lot in there okay it's a vibrant pink because it's a mix of watermelon and phase berry and both of those by themselves are very vibrant so this is interesting it's very very pink yeah um, this is, I'm gonna try to thoroughly mix this because I've I want this to be as not gritty as possible. If that's a term. Watermelon and phaseberry. I don't know. Maybe this will be good. Actually, this one's pretty good. It tastes more watermelon than phaseberry purely because I put more watermelon in. But still, this is pretty good. Honestly, I like this. Okay, so what we're mixing now is watermelon and peach mango. Again, I don't know how well this is going to taste. But honestly, I think it's going to be okay. Considering it's just two fruits. It's not like... Or it's actually it's peach mangoes too. It's only like three, two flavors, three fruits. I don't like all the other ones are a bunch of mixed fruits. So I honestly don't think this one's going to be very like, I don't know. This is going to be an interesting color. I think, I don't know actually what colors this is going to turn out to be. But let's just shake this up and see. So it's kind of almost like a really light pink. It looks orange on camera. Whoa. It's starting to actually turn orange. Okay, so maybe it's a darker orange than it is on camera. Um, but then again. Never know. So, so this one is like the tropical rain and Faceberry one. It's very, very bland. This one is not as good as the other ones. So, I this one is probably ranked last out of all of them. But you know, it's still good. I would drink it, but it's not my favorite. My favorite still is tropical rain and watermelon, just because they're set, they're like almost diverse like flavors so they like I don't know, they're just good together okay so the second to last combination we have is gonna be phase berry and peach mango we've yet to do this flavor so let's get right to it all right so here we go this is gonna be peach mango and phase berry I'm mixing up now it's kind of open Ooh, okay uh, yeah so this is phase berry and peach mango mixed together this is gonna be sort of a pinkish color like the last one uh, yeah I've, I have a feeling this one's gonna sort of taste the same but let's find out um, I think it looks like it's mixed enough Actually, this one's a little bit better than the watermelon peach mango one. I would rank this over watermelon peach mango. So right now, in order, this is a difficult ranking to do. But the first one, the, in first place, we have the first mixture. In second place, we have the third mixture. In third place, we have the second mixture. Sorry, confusing. In fourth place, we have the fourth, fifth mixture. And in sixth place, we have the sixth mixture. I think that's all. One. Two, three. Very confusing with the brain. I, I think there's six mixtures, maybe? Six or five, I don't know. Anyway, guys, this is probably the part you've all been waiting for. We're gonna be mixing all four of these flavors. I'm not gonna be mixing any of the packets I have, uh, considering I just like those packets so much. And if this tastes terrible, I do not wanna waste one of those packets. So I'm just gonna be mixing all of the four tubs I have, which is Phase Berry, Tropical Rain, Peach Mango, and Watermelon. So let's get to it. All right, guys, so I filled this one all, all the way up. That way it's easier to do the mixing, or yeah, to do the mixing. So I only have to do a quarter scoop of each instead of like an eighth scoop or something, so. Um, so what? I made a full thing of G Fuel. It's probably going to taste terrible anyways, but we're mixing all of the flavors just for you guys and this is going to taste so bad. So I guess first we're going to throw in peach mango. So we're going to just do a quarter scoop like we've been doing. There's a quarter scoop of peach mango. Nice. Then we're going to do a quarter scoop of phase berry. There we go. We got a quarter scoop of phase berry in here. Now we're throwing in Tropical Rain. Got some diverse colors going on here. <laughs> but last but not least, we're gonna be throwing in some watermelon. So here we go. We got, yeah, it's looking pretty interesting in the cup now. We got a mix of like this weird, like green, orange, and a few, and like this reddish color. So this will just add in a darker red, but it's kind of difficult to mix all these. I'm kind of curious if I'll be able to distinguish all the flavors. Um, I'll know which ones are in there, but I won't. don't know if I'll be able to distinguish them. Okay, so I'm going to show you guys. It looks pretty interesting. But this is what we're, 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 this is what we're working with right now. 
that's that's just great it looks it's starting to mix sort of so I'm just gonna start shaking this up this is gonna turn out to be a very odd color it's gonna be like a gray that's my guess or like a very very faded pink or purple honestly I don't think I put in enough tropical rain because it's sort of pinkish orangish colored but you know what we're just gonna roll with it this is what it looks like it actually it's quite accurate on camera this time around it might be a little bit darker in real life but that's okay this is probably gonna be very bland or and or disgusting so it kind of just smells like fruit because <laughs> that's kind of what it is but a mash of fruit together I can't even distinguish the smells but let's just oh god <laughs> I'm gonna be completely honest. This is actually good. Now, <laughs> I know what you're thinking. Mixing all these flavors is what I thought, honestly, was gonna be absolutely disgusting. It's actually good. Like, it's good. Like, this is probably number three on my list. So, that is so surprising. It's actually, it's, it's good. Like, it's not bad. It's good. I expected, uh, this to like none of these flavors to combine well whatsoever especially with this but it's actually good like it's not bad it's delicious this is definitely number three or two on the list I'm saying I'm definitely gonna be mixing this pre like more like all these to more together but still tropical rain and watermelon takes number one obviously you know it's the best I am ex still extremely surprised that this is good it's like a, f a mash of just like fruits it's not like strong though like I expected it to be very strong it's not that strong all the flavors are nice and subtle and it's a full thing but all the all the flavors are subtle like it's not like this just mash of flavors colliding against each other they're very like like when you take a drink you're like oh yeah I taste the tropical rain but also there's a little bit of peach mango and you can taste like the raspberries and stuff from the phase berry and you can obviously you can taste the watermelon but they're not like colliding they're all like you taste all of them at a different time honestly this is very very good it's a lot better than I expected completely I thought this was gonna be absolutely disgusting anyways guys this is gonna be a very long video I apologize if it's like really long I don't intend for it to be super long but thank you guys so much for watching this video if you like this video Make sure you go drop a like down below, subscribe if you're new, and I will see everyone in the next video. Peace out.